It is an effort to let callers share more than just their voice. And KCRG TV 9's Molly Swain visited dispatch for the Lynn County Sheriff's Office today to learn more about this program, a program that not everyone is using right now. That's right, Jim. It's called Prepared Live, and it lets callers show 911 dispatchers a live stream from their phone, share the location within just a few feet, and a lot more. However, the tool is relatively new, and use isn't widespread just yet. With any 911 call, it's the job of dispatchers at the Lynn County Communications Division to figure out what exactly is going on and get help on the way as quickly as possible. Recently, they added a new tool to help them do just that. So whatever they are seeing with their phone video, we are seeing on the screen. Prepared Live is a system where after a person makes a 911 call, dispatchers can text them a link that allows them to stream exactly what's happening on the scene. In the case of a suspicious vehicle, it would allow us to uh, have a photo of it rather than just the description. It could provide information on a structure fire, color of smoke that's helpful sometimes for responders to um, make a plan of attack. It also can share your location or allow you to chat with a dispatcher. Lieutenant Michael Casper said in the eight months they've had the program, it hasn't been widely used yet. Probably in the last month, about three instances where we reached out to the caller, but it was declined. They chose not to or weren't able to. And part of the problem might be a concern over privacy. All of our invitations have to be accepted by the caller. We can't force a connection to their um, gallery or video or microphone when they're calling 911. Dispatchers don't send out links to everyone who dials 911, only when they think the situation calls for it. There's a lot going on when someone calls 911 Sometimes those circumstances don't allow them to manipulate the phone. But they hope the feature gets to use more often in the situations that call for it. It's very helpful information at times, and, and, and we'd like to see it grow. The tool is provided to the police department for free. Casper told me it got its start as a school emergency notification system created by Yale students. In the studio, Molly Swain, KCRG TV9 News.